it's the 16th of February and uh, I've got two cows in the back been uh, really wanted to go for a little while but it's been such vile weather it's too warm in here blowing snow and all sorts I and mean, it's still not brilliant we had to a mild day yesterday and a mild night. They are heavy, these cows. Anyway, I'm going round by Castleton to take them to Moulton because uh, I'm not quite sure I can get up the, directly up the uh, hill. Probably could do, to be honest. The big uh, carry on down at the uh, bridge again. It's covered in white vans to do with the railway. They only had it all blocked up a couple of years ago. on about with snow because there won't be any along this ridge because it was just it, it wasn't actually all that much snow I think there might have been six inches up here about three lower down but it was just so windy it was insane I think it possibly have been in some ways worse in the fields than up here because the heather and stuff tends to trap it a bit and there's only so much snow to blow and also I've got I've got new tyres on this I was talking about it last time or once before anyway coming over here because it's coming up to uh, MOT time and it's due now really from the fort 14th March, so I could do it now. But it's been in for a service and uh, check over, and uh, I put new tyres on. They weren't cheap, I think it was something like £150 a piece, but uh, you get the VAT back. It's the service and the tyres was a little under about £900, I think. So get the, the vat back, so it's not outrageous really. If I, but so the, it was a bit annoying, I suppose, that they didn't particularly need changing. They were, but they were just getting to a point where I thought that uh, they, they weren't performing very well. Like when you're taking the trailer out of the field of the sheep, I really struggled last time. So we've got somewhat more another ones of the um, Goodrich All Terrain. They have sort of rather mixed reviews. They seem to have like some people think they're the best thing since sliced bread, and others I think they can be a bit dangerous because they can slip on the wet on wet roads. Well, I think it depends a bit what you're doing. I mean, on a pickup like this, you've got a relatively large amount of power and uh, lightish on the back end. So, you know, it's quite easy to make it spin out at best of time. But I think if you're more or less used to how they behave, you're not really going to be caught out by that. There's a bit of a headwind as well, but it's really monstrously heavy, these two cows. I honestly nearly took only one. I think I would have only taken one if I had any problems at all with the other one. But uh, the trouble is that the younger one, she's a complete dimbo. So we sort of 
well, maybe it's brain, you call it brain dead, it doesn't really matter what she, she's uh, just plain bloody stupid, I wouldn't like her on her own in, in the trailer. She's, she's in with a, what, a more of a dopey sort of a limousine, a simon town, I know one of the others want to have. It only has two titties, so she's got to go. You know, they'll keep each other a bit quieter. Supposed to be some kind of subsidence going on here. See, there's, there's, there's a big cliff edge there. In fact, it's a quarry, but the, the whole valley sides are known to. Uh, here, look, what's going on here? Yeah. Ouch. It's quite a big chunk trying to drop down there. Might even have to relocate the road to the side of it. Depends whether it's doable. It's quite a nasty little uh, thing, that. straight down there and away back. It's not just snow like there was a lot of a hell of a lot of ice earlier. Which actually I, I was slightly scared myself. I didn't even have the didn't have the trailer on. Is that one saying it's still closed? Closed from the twenty second for work. But uh, I was going to BATA for some, oh it was maybe the vet actually, for some bits, but anyway. I got uh, nearly to the top and it was a sheet of ice, I knew it was icy but I thought I might get away with it because I knew it was, it had been thawing a bit, but it was literally inches thick at the top so I, I just to say held it going back down, reversing back down and that actually was probably the day I ordered these new tyres because I realised it was hardly even safe prone to getting this uh, car park, one massive snowdrift, but it hasn't been too packed. it was blowing somewhat unusual in a way, it was blowing from the south. Well it's not that unusual when you when you come into a breakdown period to have a, uh. a bit of a southerly blizzard. But it doesn't matter anyway because it still should for the uh, lockdown carry on.
Oh, going to flow down there. again. It doesn't, doesn't say anything about gas. They did.